guys, Darkest Dave here. Um, today I'm going to be showing you, as I promised, one of uh, the episodes showing you what guys are OP'd on the server, and what guys are on, and uh, what the best healers. Now, for the healers, I can't tell you it's all about favorite. The healers are all good, they're all really strong. It just depends on favoritism. My favorite would be the Druid. They're amazing with their healing overtimes and they cannot die. They don't need a cask, they can fake cast and use up a um, use up a counter spell so your members can freely cast. That's why I love them so much. <laughs> now, the DK everyone, the DK I'd say for the top DPS, top DPS. Now, the DK Blood Death Knights Oh my damn, they are so strong, I don't think I've released a video, if I have, the video will be right here, but if I haven't, I'll make one, um, yeah, okay, the t they're so good on damage, the blood DKs, now if you're starting to create a guy, I'd suggest going blood first with the 90, instant 90, and then later on, turn into frost, because then you can hit 350k, yes, I said it, 350k, damage that's a one shot on people because you are so overpowered frost DKs are just unlimitedly strong all right all right now the mage they are so strong but they need a little bit of gear they are weak in the beginning I admit yes but the mage are so strong in the end, not towards the end, I'd say towards the middle. They can be so strong even halfway into their gearing. They can get the shoulders, chest, helmet and hands. And then they're strong. They don't need a weapon. They don't need an offhand. They are so strong. I've just never seen a class this strong besides a DK. Now we're going to go into the rogues. Oh my gosh. These things bloody one shot you. Literally, they, they just one shot you with one ability. Now, this is only in the orbs map, but they can still three shot you. You can't even do anything. If you trinket, you'll get lucky, maybe. But otherwise, you're screwed. Not lying, speak from experience, and was really pissed off from it. Now, the assassin is the popular class to play as a rogue. Um, they're double. Uh, I, I want to try combat. But they're multi uh, multi I think it's. I don't know. It's that double one where they stab like that. Um, that build is just so strong for an uh, open attack. Then we're gonna. Oh yes, I forgot to tell you. Fire Mage. Their Pyroblast instant spell is so strong. If they can crit once, and they pull off that third crit, um, what while they have their Pyroblast, if they cast a Pyroblast and a critic strikes, they can cast another one. Literally, they can do it over and over again, but they just got to guarantee their crits. If they can do that, they are unstoppable, no lie. Um, next, <clears throat> we're going about the Druid. The Druid, I told you why he's good for healing, but I cannot tell you why, which is the best healer. Now going on to DPS. Um, the Monk is so strong for DPS. They can, I literally 2v1 to two rogues the other day. Flying kicked into them. One rogue vanished. I was DPS in the rogue out, um, out of van, out of stealth, and the other one stabbed me in the back, trinketed, popped my healing abilities, so I can heal myself, and they get DPS. So, and touch a karma. It's so strong. It's like a rebound. It's just overpowered. Shaman. I tried healing with him. He runs out of mana too fast. <laughs> but he's good. Warlocks. Holy crap. They're strong. I suggest getting these shoulders in the beginning, they're heroic, and they're only 2200 PV points. They're heroic, really good, extremely good, holy crap. Now, if you want to see some gameplay from my druid, it'll be right here. Click on this box, and you can go watch some gameplay from my druid. If you want to watch a rogue, right here, click on this box, and you can watch a rogue. Now, uh, priest, they're weak. When they have no gear, they're weak. I'm talking about the best DPS straight up when they when you spawn, and that would be the Blood Death Knight. They don't die. They literally don't die. Um, 
if this video gets as popular as the last one where it hit it's hitting 300 views guys thank you so much it hit 300 views again I tell you what I'll do a tutorial video on how to make a badass blood DK a really badass one just to start out with all the enchants all the different ruins um, yeah all the class specs and everything uh, by the way uh, warriors I haven't I haven't started but warriors are really strong on DPS arms if you get that avatar the avatar ability that thing just boosts your damage by far now um, let's see let's check out what else we got and what we're missing now uh, I have to introduce monks shaman priest hunters yes hunters are so strong but they are so squishy too you need to have a healer with you at all times or else you're gonna be so weak now in this patch marksmanship is the strongest hard hitting one with their aim shot marksmanship hunters are not strong unless they have a little bit of gear in the beginning they're kind of weak but they can still do damage but in the beginning like I said they're very squishy towards later on they're not squishy and this has been the video on strongest DPS um, weakest DPS best healer but I can't tell you that it's all about favoritism guys because every healers crap unless you get gear like my druid but he's got gear don't worry about that but uh, thanks for watching guys like subscribe and remember what I said if this gets up to 300 viewers I'll show you a full tutorial on how to make a badass blood DK right from the start on the server thanks for watching guys you're the best